So this is Joe Jett. Welcome to the chamber, outside the chamber. And I have my good friend, State Representative Charlie Collins here. And uh, Representative Collins was last year, last session had my job as Chairman of Revenue Tax. In this session, uh, in the 90th General Assembly, uh, Chairman Collins is Chairman of Insurance and Commerce. So he, uh, he and I work good together and good friends. So uh, Representative Collins, good seeing you. Good to see and you, Representative us, Jett. And tell us what you're working on this session. Well, we're always working on tax cuts together, as you know, so I love being on your committee uh, here in the tax committee, and I think we're going to continue to do great things on the tax front. Mm -hmm. uh, this past week, I ran a bill, uh, HB 1077, which will give uh, college professors and other full-time employees of college campuses the opportunity to carry on campus if they have a concealed carry permit. And the purpose of the bill is to deter these crazy killers that come to uh, gun-free zones mm -hmm. where there are lots of innocents and, and murder them to try and make a name for themselves. Uh, a lot of studies, particularly a study done by the Secret Service and the Department of Education back in 2004, it really demonstrated that the profile of these kinds of killers is one where they're very meticulous, they plan, and it's really about trying to create a theater or a spectacle for themselves mm -hmm. so that they can kind of die as martyrs. Mm -hmm. And they don't want to have to face anybody with a gun, so if we allow concealed carry holders who work at universities, we can get the right balance to help protect our loved ones. Well, I know that and Representative Collins ran this bill last week in the and, and committee, Education Committee, and it fell in Committee 1010 vote. So are you planning on bringing the bill back up in the committee again? Yeah, as you know, there's a couple different ways things can be done. My goal here, since the 10 Republicans voted for the bill and the 10 Democrats voted against the bill, um, is to see if we can come to an alignment where I can work with the Democrats on committee and make the bill more palatable. Okay. Um, so are you, are, you, are you looking at amending your bill as to, as to say the, the faculty members and professors carrying guns on campus that's go to an active shooter class or something like that. Is that, is that I'm willing doing? to look at that. I'm willing to look at some other things. I want to be careful that what we're not doing is saying, State Police of Arkansas, you run the concealed carry program. We're going to claim your program's not good enough. Mm -hmm. However, and I'm also don't want to put professors in, in, a, in a spotlight so that their bosses who may disagree with them very much politically um, may be putting undue mm -hmm. pressure on them. But at the same time, I'm very open to making sure that they're competent and, and people can feel as comfortable as possible. There won't be an act, accident mm -hmm. in a college type of a situation. Yeah, yeah. So this is this is kind of a little bit a snapshot what you're seeing today is some of the issues that we work through and some of the behind the scene thought process. And uh, I wish uh, Representative Charlie Collins all the best of luck with this piece of legislation. And I think uh, uh, he's truly one of the good guys and he'll get this piece of legislation out and uh, it's hard to protect the people of Arkansas. So thank you very much. Thank you, Joe. Appreciate it.